everyone, it's Diane here and I'm here at home. Maybe some of you are wondering why I'm not in Northern California for the wedding that I was invited to. Well, I should be in Santa Rosa right now, probably in the hot tub or finishing off breakfast and uh, possibly seeing my YouTube friends sometime in the next few days. Uh, I, got, I would have arrived last night. Well, at about five, I would have arrived. So the wedding is supposed to be tonight from five to 10 and it's still gonna be tonight. Unfortunately, there's a chance of rain, so I don't really know the details. I haven't talked to the bride, but um, she's really busy, but I hope she's got something planned because her wedding was um, a backyard wedding in, in her backyard and catered and uh, DJ coming in, playing music and dancing and dinner outside, grilling. So um, hopefully that won't be canceled, that won't, the rain won't affect that, hopefully. I'm sure it won't be canceled, but hopefully the rain won't affect the wedding. But anyways, the reason why I'm not going is my stepmother decided at the last minute, and I mean Wednesday, today's Saturday, we were supposed to fly yesterday, that she didn't want to go. And she was my traveling partner. My dad has a bad back and he's not feeling well. And so I was going in his place to be with her and we were traveling together, staying at the hotel, and, um, <clears throat> excuse me, um, going to the wedding, and then hanging out with the family, the step family, for a while, and hanging out at the hotel and stuff like that. So um, I don't, I don't want to say why she canceled because it's kind of personal. I don't think she'd want me to put that up on here. Some of my Facebook friends and family watch my YouTube channel. So, and I do post some of my videos on YouTube. I'm not, I mean, on Facebook. I'm not gonna post this one on Facebook though, but um, she just canceled and so she got a refund on her hotel because it was within 24 hours and she got a, a refund on her plane ticket. She bought my plane ticket in my hotel room. We each had our own rooms and my hotel ticket. I was gonna pay her back if she wanted me to. She wasn't sure, but um, so the, ho the plane ticket um, to and from Hollywood Burbank Airport to Santa Rosa, Charles Schulz um, Airport. So it was airfare she canceled and she, she had insurance on her, on her airplane tickets. So she got her money back, but she had minus the insurance, of course. So anyways, um, I don't have anyone to go with. I don't want to go to the wedding by myself and I'd have to hang out at the hotel and I just didn't want to do that. So it's kind of last minute plans for me. I already sent my gift up there, that's good. I already I gave her some gift cards to a, a restaurant they like. But um, I won't be at the wedding and I was gonna video at the wedding, it was gonna be really fun and I was gonna possibly see a YouTube friend there, you know who you are, and do collab, uh, a collab videos or maybe just my own videos. But it would have been really fun and um, so I'm disappointed. But anyways, let me show you my new shoes. I did get these shoes for the wedding but I'm gonna keep them. I'm not gonna return them. They were about 99 something. And they're from Tuck Shoes. That's T-U-K-S-H-O-E-S.com. But I think, I don't know if you call them T-U-K or Tuck because here's their box. It's T-U-K. It's They put like a dot in between the T-U and the K. So I don't know if they're called T-U-K shoes or just Tuck. But they make creepers that are like shoes from the 80s and nine, well, mostly from the eighties, I wore creepers and um, they make other kind of shoes that are similar to creepers, creeper sneakers and creeper boots, I think. And they make, most of their shoes are unisex. They come in men's and women's sizes. These the ones I bought here are unisex, but they make different widths. These are the high ones. They make low shoes. They make medium, these are mediums. They make super high ones and they make women's shoes only too, but these are unisex. So these aren't real leather. They do make leather shoes and the leather shoes are about the same price as their vegan shoes. And these are them. I was gonna wear a black and white outfit to the wedding and these would match perfectly. Let's see, hold them up. Hold on. <laughs> okay, there we go. And as you can see, they're high. They're very, um, they make me about maybe two inches, two and a half inches taller. So I really like that because I'm only five, two and a half. So it makes me, it makes me about five, four and a half or five, five. 
So that's pretty cool. And um, they're lightweight. It even says on this thing that they're like new lightweight. It says right here something about them being lightweight. But it does say that they're tuck skin and they're vegan. So anyways, I'm not going to return them. I'm just going to keep them for when I dress up. So anyways, they would have been perfect. The, the wedding was uh, um, garden party casual is what it said on the invitation on the online invitation. So I was gonna wear like a black V-neck, black and white, black V-neck uh, top with like gray highlights on it, gray uh, like stitching, and then white pants with black specks through it, and then these shoes, it would've looked really good. So anyways, that was my outfit, and uh, I'm kind of disappointed. But anyways, um, that's it, and thanks for watching, and um, what else? Um, it's really cold here in LA. It's like, uh, it's only gonna be in the 70s. The last few days, it's only been in the 70s, and for the summer, that's really cold here. Um, it's usually in the 90s and above where I live in Sherman Oaks, which is the San Fernando Valley of Los Angeles. It's, a, it's part of Los Angeles. It's a neighborhood of the neighborhood of Sherman Oaks is where I live but we're part of the San Fernando Valley, which includes many different neighborhoods of LA. So and it gets hotter here, about 10 degrees hotter in, this, in the summer than it is in LA, sometimes even more than 10 degrees hotter. But hopefully in a few days, it'll be back to being the 90s again, it's supposed to be. Anyways, thanks for watching. I'm really bummed. I'm not going to the wedding. I have to accept it. I would be there right now. I'd be getting ready. For, well, I'd be, I'd be in the hot tub or hanging out at the hotel probably. But anyways, take care. Have a good day. Thanks for watching. Bye.